At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It is Chelsea facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, as a youngster growing up, this was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup final, walking out in front of 100,000 fans at Wembley, broadcast around the world, it still brings a tingle to my spine. And I'm really looking forward to this one. Number 10, number 21, Ben Chilwell. Number 19, Mason Mount. Number 11, Timo Werner. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Thiago Silva plays with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Matteo Kovacic in central midfield. And Timo Werner starts alongside Romelu Lukaku. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. is underway well, can they be creative from here Rudiger this is Thiago Silva Timo Werner Mount and how about that for a save? <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. On the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. Given away by Chelsea. Gundogan. A real defensive commitment there. Lukaku. Chilwell. Well, it could be on for him here. And a decent save, full credit. Played over, and did his job defensively. He's gone for goal. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. An alert intervention. Well, what a start to the game that would have been. They certainly can't come closer than that. And teammates to play it to. And disappointing for the players of the centre that it didn't reach them. Tremendous block. And this situation could be dangerous. Oh, there's the goal! That gives City the lead in the final. Will it prove to be decisive? Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back heel, but you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. So Chelsea restart the game. Can they come up with an answer?
Thiago Silva. Timo Werner! Well, it wasn't quite as dangerous as I thought it might be. Grealish. It's with Joao Cancelo. Committed challenge. Crucial intercept. Well, the referee might have to send him off. Well, only a yellow card, but was there a case for a red one, Stuart? Well, maybe so. I think he's got a bit lucky there. I think he stopped a clear goal-scoring opportunity. Well, the free kick lacking just a little bit of guile. Lukaku, he's in behind. And just missing the target. Well, they're at least making chances. Now they need to be more clinical. And he's beaten him here. Kovacic. Now with Mount. It's a good-looking ball in behind. And pushed onto the woodwork. And the keeper hangs on at the second attempt. Well, he's done really well, hasn't he? Great stop and then the reaction. Mares. Might be able to set up the chance. And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. This could be the equaliser. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made from moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace and transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, but should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. Gundogan. De Bruyne now. Chilwell. Werner. Has a go. Oh, it's in to give them the lead in the final. The stuff that dreams are made of. Well, here it is again, and having got a touch on it, he'll be a little bit disappointed he didn't keep it out. It was a good effort, though. Questions have been asked of Manchester City. Now it's all about their answers. Difficult to stop him. Good looking move this. And will it be the leveller? And they could face difficulties here. 
Well, it's been quite clear that Chelsea have been second best in terms of possession, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Foul there, free kick awarded. Can they extend their lead? And the spot kick is converted as coldly as you like. Well, let's take another look because this is how to take a penalty. He strikes it with such confidence and composure. It's a brilliant penalty. the action and 3-1 the scoreline at the moment that is that for the first half here Back in business, and no sugarcoating it. There was a big gulf between them in the first half. Will we see a response from City in the second? Oh, super piece of play. Preferring to go infield. Now oh, just the tackle that was needed. Chilwell. Conte. Could play it in. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. Ferran Torres. Here's Mares. And in the perfect position to read it. Rodri. Oh, lovely incisive pass. It could be for De Bruyne. And there is the goal! Well, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Well, the action underway again. Can City go hunting for an equaliser now? Aspili Quetta. Romelu Lukaku now. Thiago Silva. N'Golo Conte now Chelsea in a position of menace Matteo Kovacic in the centre a decisive clearance it was well we're into the final half hour can they do something positive on the counter attack Joao Cancelo Chilwell now Conte Conte Lukaku Werner with it now Aspiliqueta well read to ease the pressure 
Well, City, as the stats highlight, have had most of the ball. But most of their passing has been in deeper areas. Unless they start getting it into their front players with better quality, they'll struggle to turn this one around. And he read it well, intercepting it. Gundogan. Mares. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Christensen. Lukaku. Priority was to hang on to the ball, which he did. And a poor ball. Mares. This could level it. No way through. Piliqueta always going to be the goalkeeper's ball ten minutes to go and the counter looks on here options available De Bruyne Firing it towards goal, making sure it didn't get past him. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Gundogan. Effective challenge. Lukaku. Can he play it in? Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Gundogan. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment.